This video demonstrates how to create an intake reversible bumper using RoboPromo's pre-sewn material. The first step in the process is to apply your team numbers to the material. Do this by centering the numbers over the middle sewn seam and align the Velcro so that it is on the top on the red side and on the bottom on the blue side. After removing the cover from the numbers, reapply heat to ensure that all the edges are firmly attached. Now take the 5x6 angle cut bumper fixture with the 3 quarter inch overhanging noodles and slide that into the bumper material sleeve. Pull it tight to get it snug against the back and align the middle of the noodles with the sewn seam. Fold the back of the material over the wood and staple it in place. Fold the edges over and secure them in place with the staple gun as well. To make the next steps a little easier, you can cut a V-shape out of the open end of the material. This will make the final folding process easier to complete. Now flip the piece right side up again and find the edge of the bumper. Make a mark there with a pen or pencil and use scissors to cut along the stitched line and above the sewn seam. It is important to note that you only cut the two top layers of the material as those are excess and will be discarded. Double check to make sure you do not accidentally cut three layers. Now you can take the bottom layer and fold it like a Christmas present. Pull it tight and staple it in place. Turn the piece back over and draw lines on the excess material following the edge of the bumper foam underneath. Cut along those lines to remove the unnecessary material. You can now attach the Velcro pieces to the hard parts of the bumper. The intake reversible bumper construction is now complete and you can easily change from one bumper color to another in a matter of seconds.